Welcome to your chakra card reveal for card number four. I'm Robin Carline from Robin's Authentic Tarot and I thank you very much for visiting my channel. Now, this card is <laughs> very, very different from the last three cards. This one here is the third eye chakra. Now, for this one, this, what I feel most profoundly about, I mean, first off, looking at the picture there and what that represents, perception, perception, how you look at things and how there are so many different ways to look at one experience, one thing. So for all of the situations, for all of the transitions, for all of the changes, big and small changes, there are so many ways to look at one thing. There are various ways to perceive different situations, experiences that you are currently going through. This is a different ways to decipher things. So this is something that I do uh, for a living. And this is something that you can all do. And that's what I always try and tell everyone is you don't have to have, we all possess the same skills. And so to really utilize those and to really focus on your intuition, to really focus on your gut feeling and to know that moving into this age of Aquarius, this new era energy that we are in, that there is a heightened intuition. There is a heightened understanding. There is a heightened way of looking at things, perceiving things, dealing with things, understanding things. So while you are allowing your third eye chakra to be open, when you are asking the universe, God, source, spirit, for your window to be open, for your third eye chakra to be open, and allow yourself to see all of the, 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 the images the sounds, the smells, all of the senses that you're receiving and allow yourself to decipher and allow yourself to say, okay, so I see it from this way. Now, what other ways can I see it from? And so now I'm going to take it into the experiences that you individually yourself have been experiencing and transitions that you've been experiencing and something that you thought meant one thing actually means so much more. Okay. And so I'm, I'm asking you to deep dive into all of the things that you have been, that you've been experiencing as in uh, things have been unfolding for you. Things have been changing. Things have been falling into place. Things have been maybe out of your control. So I'm talking about all the things, positive and negative, looking at things from all different perspectives and having that, that whoa moment having that oh my gosh you know what that that could actually mean this or this does mean this and this means that I can move in this direction or actually it means that I could maybe leave this all together maybe this means that I could start something else like it just creates so much oh my gosh you know what look at all the possibilities look at all of the things that are open to me and I'm just not stuck in a box or I'm not stuck behind this window the, the window flaps have opened and there's so much more now. And that's what I want you to focus on for this week because you're going to really need these skills for the rest of your life. Because as I've been saying, intuition is really, really heightened, but there's a lot of things. Remember, we are in the age of Aquarius, so there's that air energy. So that is all of the communication. So the way you communicate with yourself, the way that you honor yourself, the way you communicate to other people, the way you express yourself, the way you see and perceive things, third eye, then all of the things that you are receiving from source energy, we are receiving so much top 
three chakras. That is it. I'm not, that's not it, but that is, <laughs> that is the energy that we are in. That's what you want to focus on. Okay. You want to really focus on all of those things because that's what's really, really prevalent right now while maintaining that balance of your other chakras. There's so much, there's so much. We are being given so much. There's so much transition happening. Just know that things aren't supposed to stay the same, okay? Things are supposed to grow and evolve. You are supposed to grow, evolve, and change. And it can be absolutely terrifying and paralyzing, but it can also be so much incredible, amazing growth that you've only wished to experience and it's happening now. If you have any questions about that, please let me know. We can have a private message, email me, and just let me know things that are going on or like if you want to share. Um, and I can just, you know, give you my insight or encouragement or whatever that is, or just to listen. So I thank you so much for showing up for yourself. I thank you for showing up and listening to me. And I thank you so much for all of your support for my channel. These readings, all four of them were absolutely huge and phenomenal. And this week is just so big and there's just so much more bigger stuff that's coming, but it, it is exciting. There's a lot of growth. There's a lot of positivity. And I want you to remember that. I love you all. Mwah. Have an amazing week.